acoustic noise compensation is a dynamic processor that automatically adjusts the level of a signal depending on ambient background noise. This is equivalent to having an automatic volume control. These processors require a microphone to capture ambient noise and can provide control over their threshold, ratio, rate, maximum and minimum gain, etc. The structure is similar to any other dynamic processor. In this processor, the sidechain input is used for the ambient sensing microphone. The detector is just looking for the background noise to determine level. The gain computer calculates how much gain needs to be applied or subtracted from the signal to compensate for variation in background noise. The threshold is a user-defined level that establishes what's the minimum acceptable background noise for the processor to start working. We also need to set a maximum compensation level. This is the maximum gain that the processor will apply to a signal and it's used to protect amplifiers and loudspeakers. When passing a signal through this processor, if the noise is below the threshold level, the output will be maintained at unity gain. If the ratio is set to 1 to 1 and the noise floor raises above the threshold, the gain will increase at the same rate as the noise, but only up to the maximum compensation level. Acoustic noise compensation allows using other ratios. This will make the system increase the level at a higher rate than the noise floor, or if the ratio is below, the signal will increase at a slower rate. A docker is a dynamic processor that reduces the level of a signal when another signal, the sense, is present. This processor is normally used for voiceover and paging applications as we can mix the sense signal, usually a microphone, with a process signal. They can provide control over the threshold, ratio, and rate. The structure is very similar as we have seen before. The only difference is the ability to mix the sidechain signal with the process signal. In this case, the detector is only checking that the sidechain input is above the threshold. Once that happens, the gain computer will establish how much gain reduction needs to be applied at the gain controller. Through the processor, the sidechain signal is never altered. It always maintains unity gain. Any signal passing through the docker will be unaffected as long as the sidechain signal is below the threshold. Once the sidechain signal goes above the threshold, that input signal will be reduced by a fixed amount. An automatic gain controller is a processor that can add or subtract gain to a signal so it remains as close as possible to a target level. As with all dynamic processors, they act only on valid signals that are above the threshold. If we pass a signal through an automatic gain controller and this signal is above the threshold but below the target level, the AGC will add gain until the output is at the target level. If the incoming signal suddenly drops below the threshold, the output of the AGC also drops but only while the signal is above the threshold. Once the signal is below the threshold, no processing is done. If the incoming signal resumes the previous level, the AGC will return its output to the target level. But in the other hand, if the input level rises above the target level, the AGC will reduce the output signal to bring it down back to the target level. This processor is ideal for microphones to compensate for different talkers.